Welcome to another quick tutorial in Cinema 4D. In today's tutorial, we are going to learn how to create glass dispersion effect. First, we add or create our model and the floor. Now, let's create a normal material and drag it to our plane and select a color that will reflect on our model edge. Now, go and add a metallic surface for our reflectance and set the specular strength to 5. Now, let's add our dome light and increase the exposure if it's needed. And you can also use a tint color to adjust the color of the image you are going to use. Disable the background and add your iridescent edition image that you can find it on Google. Set the type that works for you. I use angular and flip horizontal. Now let's add our camera. I set the focal length to 80 millimeters and now enable the exposure and set the f-stop number lower. And add your warm or cold color. And then select the black crash and increase the saturation. Now enable the bloom and you can play with the values until you get the best result. Now let's create a new redshift material and add it to our model. First let's add a ramp and connect it to our refraction roughness. Now let's add a trip planner and connect it to our RAM. Now we need to add our scratches for more details on our model and connect it to our trip planner. Now go to trip planner and play with the scale value. Now go and set your RAM. More black means less scratches. Now to our material, set the diffuse color to black. For reflection, increase the roughness. Now set the sheen weight to 1 and set a smaller roughness value. Now check the refraction and deselect link to reflection. Increase the samples and set the IOR value and set the dispersion to 4 and that's it we are done you can now also set the composition tag to our plane and disable scene by camera and we are done i hope you enjoyed this tutorial